So I'm kind of at a crossroads. <sighs> I have been experiencing days where I just want to sleep all day. Um, yesterday I was sick, like actually like sick, sick, like I had a bug of some sort. Um, I feel better like today. Um, and I know like as a Foxy and I mean, as anybody, you should listen to your body. Like if your body is telling you it needs sleep and sleep, but I'm like trying to like decide, like I like want to push through it. And go ahead and start my exercises. Like, I want you so bad. <laughs> but there's part of me that's like, bed. There's a nice, comfy bed in there. And then another part of me is like, turn on some music and get your exercise on. But then I'm like, but my body's telling me I need to sleep. But my brain's telling me I don't need to listen to my body. So I'm not really sure what to do here. If I do end up exercising, I probably will do a video on it just because it's the first actual exercising that I've done since I've been blocked, like actual routine. Um, I have to work around the muscles that um, tend to give me trouble, and that's going to be a uh, challenge. Um, I mean, I know I can do it, it's just gonna be a challenge, and it's like it's all sunny and bright and everything. And I was just like, I want to be awake and, and everything, but then the other part of me is just like, I just want to go to sleep. So that's my dilemma right now. We got my other video loading up, and I'm debating right now what I want to do. Cause there's a lot involved. Okay, like I have to like change clothes, of course. Like, cause I have to get into like a sports bra and like a comfy, like, comfy clothes. And right now I'm in jeans and a t-shirt. I had to, you know, put my hair fully up. I have to get my yoga mat out and put the music on and get out my paper and pen and write down what I'm going to do and set goals and write everything down and videotape it while I'm doing it and I'm just wore out thinking about it. <laughs> I don't know what to do people. Uh, what I want to do is a few um, muscle exercises, um, maybe a little bit of yoga and stretching, and then go for a walk. Because my dog needs to go for a walk and she's getting fat. We can only use the I'm a little husky joke so many times on her. She's just fat. <laughs> So, I mean, you know, she could use a nice walk anyways. But I don't know what to do. Because I'm also, I mean, like, I have no pain medication either. So, you know, if I start hurting, then I'm, like, screwed. Because I can't take ibuprofen, of course. And Tylenol does nothing for me. So, and, oh yeah, I found out today that, um... Pain management sent all of my doctors nice little pieces of paper saying that I am um, I'm no longer allowed at, at their pain management center because I um, sought out other places for medication and got medication at other um, sources or whatever. And I'm like the only other place I got medication from was the hospital that I was rushed to. And I left you a voicemail telling you I went to the hospital. I didn't tell you which hospital I went to. I didn't tell you what the, that they gave me anything. And you didn't ask me about that. So, how would you even know? And that's nobody else's concern. 
So again, they're violating my rights. So not just yeah. Anyways, um, how exercise thing. I'm still debating on that. Like, I want to listen to my body, but then again, I want to get my body in gear. Does that make sense? I guess we'll see. Uh, pajamas and blanky one. <laughs> I'm so tired. I wanted so bad. <laughs> I went into my room to change and I was looking at my closet, looking at my workout outfit, and then I was looking at my drawers. Where my pajamas are. I kept looking back and forth. Back and forth. Back and forth. I feel ashamed. But my blankies are so snuggly. And I'm using the excuse that I'm listening to my body. I mean, I... I feel like I could just fall asleep talking right now, so, I mean, obviously I'm tired, I don't know why, but I am, so I guess I'm going to take a nap, night night. <laughs>